Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. And today we're talking about Platinum Games because they have just revealed Project GG plus a whole lot more. So let's get right into it everyone. As we all know, Platinum Games has started their Platinum 4 initiative where they will reveal four new games in 2020. The first game was the remaster of the 1 for 101 and now we have the second one which is called Project GG. Lead director of Platinum Games, Hideki Kamiya has gone to Famitsu Magazine to disclose all the information and we even have a translation about this new Project GG, so let's get right into it everyone. As you can see here, it states this. First game, Platinum owns the IP of 100% and are self-publishing. The game is completely different than anything they've made before and they want to exceed and betray expectations. Beautiful Joe is a transformative hero like Kamen Rider. Wonderful 101 is a hero squadron. GG is a huge hero. The action feel of the game is important but not the main focus of the title. Launching on all existing platforms as long as they can. The goal is to have 100 people working on it but 15 people are actively working on it now. Tencent offered to publish and fund this game but Platinum refused because they want full control and ownership. Last two Platinum 4 projects are new and not ports. The final one is a big secret and is very interesting. Now there are a lot of takeaways from all this information. One big one is that last statement there that says the last two Platinum 4 projects are not ports, they are new titles. And the last one is very interesting, I wonder what they could be. Also, this new title, Project GG, is completely owned and published by Platinum Games themselves. They have no help from anybody, not Tencent, not Nintendo, anyone else. This is all Platinum Games, which is very good to see. And I guess the biggest takeaway is that this Project GG will focus around a huge hero which may be something like Ultraman if you've all seen the series. They have a new anime series on Netflix right now so you all should check this out if you haven't seen Ultraman. They also have a brand new teaser image that was found on Reddit as you can see here and that helmet kind of looks similar to the Ultraman helmet so maybe he uses this to go big, go use to fight some big kaiju enemies. I think this is very cool and we all know that they have some creative minds there at Platinum Games. They always go above and beyond in their action games so I can only imagine the buildings just crashing everywhere, you fighting these huge kaiju type beasts. Man, this is going to be amazing and I can't wait to see any other information that we have on this game. I'm pretty sure that it won't launch this year in 2020, probably later this year if anything, but most likely this will launch in 2021. Hopefully we do get a trailer soon. Alright everyone, that's going to do it for this video. What are your thoughts on all this information about this brand new game called Project GG? Please let me know down in the comment section below. And if you like this video, make sure to hit that like button and share this video as well. And as always, remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock. We're here, we focus on Nintendo gaming news around the clock. Catch you guys in the next one.